So here we can see on my 4K Amazon Fire Stick, I'm now accessing the zone. And if you pay attention, we can see at the top, it thinks I'm in Canada. And here we can see I'm accessing the CW network for all of those great up-to-date TV shows, series, and even movies. Here I'm accessing Zuma TV, which just has a massive library of on-demand and live content. And lastly, here I'm accessing the TNT network. Now, none of these services or these websites are normally available for anybody outside the USA. But as we can see, I'm able to access them on my device. I'm not using any VPN. I'm not using any hardware device. And I really can go ahead now and start enjoying all of this great free content. So in this video today, let me show you how you can get this working on your Fire Stick or your Android TV devices. It does have a few issues, which I will mention, but... At the end of the day, you'll definitely be able to enjoy this free content on all of your devices without any kind of VPN. So please do take a moment to hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. So with all of that being said, let's get started. If you're new to the channel and you want to stay up to date with the latest tech tutorials, the latest Fire Stick, Android and Android TV tips and tricks, then please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. It's a small click from you, but it makes a big difference to me. Thank you. So I'm doing my demonstration on the old 4K Fire Stick, but you can follow this process on any Android device, any Amazon device, or any Android TV device. Now for this process to work, you have to just install one application. And through this application, we can then install a special free plugin. And through the free plugin, we can now unlock all of this content. Now to start the process, just head over to your settings, go to My Fire TV, go to developer options, and make sure the apps from unknown sources is enabled. Once you've confirmed that, let's now press the home key and let's now open up Downloader and make a quick connection to my website, which is just techdoctoruk.com. Or you can type in the short code 53402. Let's type that in and click on go. Now, when you get to my site, if you head over to the hamburger menu, which is one with the three lines, let's click on that and click on tutorials. And the latest tutorial in the list will be how we can get this free plugin working on all of our Android devices. Let's open that up. Here we are, so we can see we can follow this process on your Fire Stick or Android TV devices. The process is absolutely free. Let's scroll down. Now the first link is for the latest version of the Kiwi browser. And what's special about this browser is it actually supports Chrome extension. So you can install this on your phone or your tablet or your Android device. And through this browser, you can actually install any official Chrome plugin. And the plugin that we're going to install is the Stream Locator plugin. And because this browser has been designed for phones and tablets, if you do this process on a Fire Stick, it does actually require the mouse toggle. So if you need that on your device, you can get that from this link here. Now in my example is I already have the mouse toggle. I'm gonna to click on the browser, scroll down, and click on this green download button. So install the browser on your device. If you do need to install the mouse toggle, install that as well. Once all of that's done, you then want to press the home key and let's now start the Kiwi browser for the first time. So as I'm doing this process on the 4K Fire Stick, the first thing I need to do is bring up my virtual mouse. If you don't want to use a virtual mouse, you can also use a Bluetooth mouse. If you don't want to use any mouse, then I'm looking for another browser which works with this plugin, which doesn't need the mouse toggle. So make sure you are subscribed with all notifications so you know exactly when that update drops. Okay, so bringing up the virtual mouse, double press the play button. Here we are. I can now go to the top and I'll click on the three dots here. And to scroll down, you press the forward key. So let me do that now. And what I'm looking for is where it says extension. So let's click on that. This now shows me a couple of options asking me where do I want to install these extensions from. Now in our case, because we have an official extension from Google, I can just go over to the left and click on where it says from store which basically means that I'm looking for an extension on the official Google Play Store. So here I can scroll down again by pressing forward key a few times and click on I agree. And let's do that now. I mean, if you were to do this on a phone or a tablet, it will be so much quicker because you'll be able to use a touch screen. Okay, so I can now go to search on the top here. Let's click on that and just search for the word stream locator, all one word. Uh, let's type that in. Let's press back on the remote. And this is the one that you want, the Stream Locator by the Geo Unlocking Experts. And I know these guys also do make a special application for the Fire Sticks, 
which is fully optimized, including for Netflix. So I will be doing a review of that in the next few days. So if you're looking for a more premium experience, especially if you don't use a mouse toggle, these guys do have an official application, which I will be reviewing in the next few days. Okay, let's now click on this here and go over to where it says add to Chrome. Let's click on that now and click on OK. And literally within a couple of seconds, we have now fully installed that plugin. So all we need to do now is just go over to the hamburger menu with the three dots. Let's click on that. I can now scroll down by pressing the forward key and we can see right at the bottom, we have the stream locator. So let's click on that now. And this is how we activate the plugin. Click on that, takes you to the plugin page and it now just needs any email address just to complete the registration. So I'm just gonna put something in here and that's it guys. That process is now completed. This plugin is now fully activated, which means we can go ahead now and unlock all of these particular applications or services directly on our Fire Stick. Now for a test, let's start with a design. So we can see by default it says here disable. But if I click on this, so I can now choose a virtual location for this application. So let's for a test, let's go for Germany. Let's click on that. We can see that's doing its stuff over there. I can now click on this link here. This should open up a new tab. And we can see in the top now it says en.de, which is the short code or country code for Germany. So Using that plugin, I can now access this service even though it's not available for me in the UK. That's working great. Now, if I want to go back to the plugin, I can now go back to the tabs at the top where it says five. I can click on that now. And let's go back to the plugin and let's access the CW network. Click on that. It again opens up another tab. Now some of these websites, they will actually only play the content if you convert the page into desktop mode. I think this is one of them, so it's very easy to do that. I can now just click on the three dots here, scroll down, and we can see one of the options is desktop site, which means give me the full version of this page. So if I tick on that, give that a second, that reloads the page. I can again see all of the content, and for a test now, if I try one of these latest episodes like Superman, click on that. And in a couple of seconds, without any kind of registration, without using any hardware device, without using any VPN, that content loads for us straight away. And we can fully enjoy that on our device. If any of you guys are still here with me, then if you drop a like on this video and leave the comment hashtag Max, then I know you made it this far in the video, which I always appreciate. I'll then heart your comment. So overall guys, a great plugin, absolutely free to use. And as you've seen that, it will allow you to unlock all of these popular services without using any VPN. I just wish that we could get a process working which didn't require a virtual mouse, but again, if you're able to put up with that slight inconvenience, it would really allow you to access all of this content. As I mentioned before, I will be reviewing their premium option, the official application for these Amazon devices. So if you guys do wanna check that out, make sure you are subscribed. Do like and share this video. Do leave me a comment below and let me know what you think about this plugin. And I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.